Hello, I'm Rob Jensen with The Rob Jensen Company, here to give you a market update on the Las Vegas and Henderson real estate market. It's August 2014, and it's been a good, good year so far. We came off a really strong 2013. 2013, the inventory was really low, um, just a hair over 3,000 homes on the market beginning of the year, which caused um, there to be multiple offer situations, bidding wars, and people paying well over appraised values last year. And we saw home prices go up somewhere between 20 to 30 percent in most areas last year. Since then, prices came up, inventories come up, and things have leveled off more. So I'm not seeing the um, that significant price increase anymore. But sometimes we are still seeing multiple offers on properties. So you know, if the property shows right and is in the right location and is priced right, um, you still might get multiple offers and have a really quick sale. So that's still exciting. Um, what I'm seeing right now is continued appraisal problems in the market. Um, it's a challenge, um, more so because in my experience, a lot of the appraisals that are coming out of these appraisal management companies aren't very strong. Um, so it can be worth, um, whether you're a buyer or a seller, knowing that that bank's appraisal may not be so accurate and you may might need to get another appraisal or possibly switch lenders. So have an open mind about that and uh, be ready to talk to your agent. There's some exciting news out there. Clearly, there's a lot of new construction going on. Um, we've got um, Ascaya and Henderson's just opened up. They've come out with pricing for their lots. Most of them have incredible strip views. Um, Discovery Land Company has announced a joint venture with Summerlin and Howard Hughes and they're gonna be um, developing just south of the ridges, and those are gonna be significantly larger lots from what I hear, maybe you know, upwards of one to three acre lots, which could be pretty exciting. We're seeing a lot of that. We're also seeing a lot of, I'm seeing a lot of remodeling lately. Um, people are running out of options for new construction um, unless they wanna build from scratch. So I'm seeing more people remodel, which, which is pretty neat. Really gives them an opportunity to get a, a really custom feel on the inside. Um, what else is going on right now? Um, it is August. We're going to be coming up on the, um, you know, weather's going to start to cool down a little bit more. I project things are still going to be active and steady. And it's a, overall, the market conditions are good because you got to remember, we're still at record low interest rates right now. Um, Michelle Pistone with Mutual of Omaha, she's been quoting some of our clients still in the 3% range, you know, and those are still for arms, three, five, and seven year arms on jumbos. But yet even four or five percent for fixed, you know, 30 year, 15 year, all those traditional mortgage products are um, still pretty relatively available. So you've got incredibly low interest rates. Um, you've got the stock market at record highs again. So, um, you know, I think the government's printing a lot of money and that has a little bit to do with that. But um, those are prime conditions to keep, a, you know, keep the economy healthy as well as the real estate market healthy. So as far as my forecast on our price is gonna to continue to go up, I, I would say they're gonna stay relatively stable right now. Um, I, I'm seeing a pretty relative balance of supply and demand. And um, so I think things are gonna be pretty stable. I, don't, I wouldn't bank on that appreciation that we saw last year. Um, and then last but not least, talking about foreclosures, short sales, shadow inventory, what's still out there. There are still short sales out there. Um, originally, Assembly Bill 284 slowed down the foreclosure or the, the short sale process. And then when banks were about to sort of pick back up again on that, then there's this homeowner bill of rights that came out and that sort of slowed things down again. So we're not 100% out of the woods with the short sales and foreclosures. Um, but there, so there will still be some more of those coming up, but hopefully not as many because obviously those don't help out with the market prices. Um, obviously, me or one of my team members would be glad to talk and help you out individually. You feel free to call my office or shoot us an email, and I look forward to talking to you. Thanks.